In this video, we're sharing six of the best ways to clean burnt pans. Stay tuned because at the end, we will be sharing the best cleaning product we've found for the job. Whether you've had a cooking mishap or the damage has happened over a long time, a scorched pan can be a nightmare. Fortunately, there are some easy hacks to restore them to their former glory. My name's Jude and I'm from Expert Home Tips, the first place you should turn to if you want to learn about DIY, home management and more. Don't forget to subscribe so that you never miss out on the latest life hacks. No matter what type of pan you're cleaning, from non-stick pans to stainless steel or even a cast iron skillet, you want to get it right. Using the wrong method could damage your pans. Let's get started with our easy methods for cleaning burnt pots and pans. First, we need to answer the question, why are my pans burning? Before we show you the ways to tackle the scorch marks, did you know that they can be prevented? You might want to change your cooking approach. There are a few different reasons why your pans end up burning, and these include turning the heat up too high, not stirring your food frequently, cooking on a dirty hob, or not cleaning residue off your pans after each use. Fix these problems and you should notice a big difference. Now, on to how to clean your burnt pans. Method number one uses lemon to clean burn marks. When you're wondering how to clean burnt pans, you may want a natural method. We've got you covered. The lemon method is what it says on the tin. You use the citrus fruit to do the hard work, getting rid of grease marks and food stains, before cleaning the pan with a cloth. Start by slicing up two to three fresh lemons into flat circles. You can place these at the bottom of your burnt pan. Next, add water and make sure that it adequately covers all of the lemon slices. Put the pan on medium heat and allow the water to heat up with the lemons. Bring the water to a boil and leave for around 10 minutes. When you've done that and the water is cool, you can remove the lemon slices and drain some of the water. Then, with a bit of water in the pan, you can use a cloth to clean the bottom. The idea is that the acid from the lemon would have loosened things up. This should mean that getting rid of burn marks is easier than it would otherwise be, so long as you use some elbow grease. Our second method uses tin foil and baking soda. The tin foil and baking soda method is the one to use if you want to clean the outside bottom of a burnt pan. It's also effective on tough stains like burnt sugar or caked on food. However, this method is not recommended for burnt stainless steel pans as it can create scratch marks. You should also take care not to scratch off the coating on non-stick pans. That's why we suggest using on non-stick pan bottoms rather than the inside. To get started, make sure you remove any of the leftover food from the pan. Next, you should put two to three tablespoons of baking soda in the bottom of the pan and add a splash of hot water. Mix the two until you have a thick paste. Take the time to cover the entire area of the burnt pots or pans and leave the paste to work its magic. After a few minutes, grab some tin foil and scrunch it into a bowl. The more jagged edges there are here, the better. That's what makes this approach effective on burnt frying pans and saucepans. Next, use the tin foil ball to scrub the bottom of the pan vigorously. When you're done, rinse well and use a cloth to shine the pan. Next, let's give washing up liquid and hot water a try. Milder burn marks require a gentle approach. If you haven't done too much damage to your pan, it's worth taking the traditional route. That means grabbing a bottle of washing up liquid and going at the pan with some hot water. Whether you're using a non-stick pan or a steel pan, you should find that this works. First things first, you need to boil the water. As you do, so squeeze some of the washing up liquid into the bottom of the burnt pan. Leave it to settle for a minute. Next, add the boiling water to the pan and leave the whole thing for a couple of minutes. Once the water has cooled down, empty the pan and clean the burnt marks. After that, you may want to repeat the process several times until the pan truly shines. This approach tends to work for an array of cooking mistakes. For example, if you have some burnt pasta plaguing the bottom of your steel cookware, this should be your first port of call. At number four, we have baking soda and vinegar. Cleaning with vinegar and baking soda is as good as you can get when it comes to traditional methods. If you're unsure how to clean a burnt saucepan, you may find that this approach works for you. The great news about this method is that you likely already have the things you need in your cupboard. That means that you don't have to buy any expensive cleaner. If you're ready to give it a whirl, follow our simple instructions. Start by putting equal parts water and vinegar into the burnt pan or saucepan. Put the pan on the heat and bring it to a boil. Next, add a couple of tablespoons of baking soda into the mixture and stir well. Remove the pan from the heat and leave the water to cool for roughly 10 to 15 minutes. After that, pour the mixture down the drain. You guessed it, the next step is all about scrubbing. Grab a sponge or scouring pad if the burn marks are tough and get to work. 
You may want to add some washing up liquid and cool water to get those burnt grease stains off. You should notice that the black burn marks have started to disappear. In at number five, we're using salt. Not got any cleaning products in your cupboard? No problem. There's a simple solution that you might not have thought of. If you have some salt lying around, and you should if you're even a half decent cook, you can use it to clean your burnt pan in minutes. We can't quite believe how many uses for salt there are. Follow these simple steps to get started. Grab a handful of salt and sprinkle it all over the burnt area on your pan or saucepan. Next, run a clean sponge under some water to make it damp. You should use the sponge to work the salt into the burnt areas of the pan. You may need to take several minutes to do this. When you have finished, rinse the pan and take a look. Salt is a fantastic abrasive, so it's worth trying this one for yourself. For our final method, we're using the pink stuff to clean your pans. This method might just be our favourite because it's so effective. If you have a brown discoloration tinge on the base of your pan, or burnt on food inside of it, the pink stuff will save the day. Coat any unsightly areas with the paste, and with a little bit of gentle scrubbing, they'll be sparkly again. It's that easy. Don't forget to rinse your pan thoroughly after using this product. Head over to our other video, Uses for the Pink Stuff, to learn more about this miracle cleaning product. Those are our top six methods for cleaning burnt pans. We hope you found them helpful. If you're still here, let us know which methods you will try and be sure to come back and tell us how you got on. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel right now. To see the complete instructions and even more hacks, head to our website experthometips.com. We've left a link in the description box below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time for more expert home tips.